Hi Shell Point, I'm Ashley Robin and I'm here with Ranger Tony from Ding Darling and we are really excited to bring a documentary to you uh, February 24th. Yes, Queen of the Sun, what are the bees telling us? I know you've all been learning about bees. It's a great documentary about the importance of bees and what you can do to help them. We have plenty of bees at Shell Point, whether it's in our gardens or in our butterfly habitat. So learn how bees are helping us at Shell Point as well as around the world and what we can do for them. Join us February 24th in the Grand Cypress Room at 1 p.m. The relationship of bees and flowers is one of the most beautiful co-evolutionary relationships we have. Bees are the legs of plants. Beekeepers, they are chosen by bees. You can gross by mustache. And they like. If bees left this world, I wouldn't like it because there would be no honey. Yeah, and no fruit. Colony collapse disorder is the bill we are getting for all we have done to the bees. If we didn't have bees to pollinate our crops, we'd have to eat just, just bread and oatmeal, you know, all the time <laughs> within a couple of nuts. If bees are dying, birds will be dying, plants will be dying. We could call it colony collapse disorder of the human being, too. Steiner's prediction has come true. So many of the problems we face come down to one thing, and that is monoculture. The bees can't even live there, they'll starve to death. From the point of view of nature, it's, it's insane. We've bred a race of super mites with every new chemical we throw at them. Pesticides came from warfare, but of course they instantly kill the pollinators. When you see an airplane spraying, there is this tremendous feeling of not being able to do anything. I really don't want to lose them. I'm really finding out why I'm beekeeping is to keep that going for my children's children. <laughs> Our very lives depend on beekeeping. The bees sort of let me know, go ahead, we'll help you. Honeybee sanctuaries are springing up like mushrooms in this country. And they're coming closer. Only in the Bronx, baby. Where are you going to find a swarm? You see that little antennae? It's lovely. Oh, look at this. Ripping with honey. People say that they can't keep bees. They're lying.